Russian forces are funneling additional forces to the Avdivka front, despite ongoing challenges with the frontal mechanized assaults and the failure of a renewed push over the past few days, says the Institute for the Study of War. Russian sources claim that Ukrainian defensive fortifications, including minefields, pose a significant challenge to Russian advances around Avdivka. Avdivka, with the pre-war population of around 32,000 people, has been a symbol of Ukrainian resistance since Russia's invasion in 2014. The frontline city, which is widely viewed as a gateway to recapturing the Russian-occupied city of Donetsk, which is about 20 kilometers away, was briefly seized by Russia in 2014, but was later retaken by Ukrainian forces, who in the next years have built solid fortifications here. Ukrainian sources stated that Russian forces continued to transfer personnel to the Avdivka direction to support offensive efforts despite heavy losses. The UK Defense Ministry says recent Russian assaults in Avdivka have contributed to a 90 percent increase in Russian casualties recorded by the Ukrainian Ministry of Defense. It is likely that Russia has suffered up to 190,000 permanent casualties killed and permanently wounded since the full-scale invasion began, with the total figure including temporarily wounded, recovered and due to return to the battlefield of up to 290 Thousand. And this does not include Wagner Group or the prisoner battalion who fought in Bakhmut.